Ultra F Sharp is an easy on RAM to learn in F Sharp in the browser. It lowers the barrier to entry to F Sharp through an outstanding in browser coding experience. How? We do that by making it available over a wide range of platforms, which do not require a full download of Visual Studio. This new version of Try F Sharp is really an evolution to keep in step with the latest version of F Sharp 3.0. What we wanted to do here is to bring these new experiences. We did that through tutorials across multiple domains, and we also brought many of the relevant type providers that F Sharp 3.0 brings, and we brought those into the browser-based experience. And those tutorials are highlighting features that are solving two things. One is the real-world analytical programming problems, things financial world. And the other one thing, the information-rich space where we are today, things data science, right? So you can learn all those great features. And now, actually, you can actually create some of your code and take this code that you created to share it with others. Software lies at the heart of our connected economy. Um, it's an essential component of uh, virtually every uh, business system. Every business transaction um, now depends upon software systems. And our ability to uh, effect business depends on our ability um, to build complex software infrastructures. In UCL, we're actually interested in making the bridge between the foundations of computer science and its practice. And actually, functional programming is an excellent vehicle for doing precisely that. The game has changed now. And development in functional programming, of which uh, F Sharp is an exemplar, have actually meant that functional programming has become a practical vehicle for tackling complex problems. The tutorials in Tri F Sharp allow organisations such as University College London uh, to teach their students and give them examples of real world problems. In the financial world, uh, F Sharp is used extensively and the tutorials provided in the Tri F Sharp website mean the students can get their hands on real world examples and see how they're applied. At UCL, we have developed programs in cooperation with the financial industry. Using Try F Sharp, the students are able to learn and progress quickly within a web-based, user-friendly learning and development environment. The research I pursue is really looking at how to bring together more information on the web. Nowadays, more and more of what's coming to the web is in the form of data rather than documents. F Sharp is a functional language by design, and one of the things that's nice about Try F Sharp is it gives us access to that very strong and very elegant programming metaphor in a way that's accessible all the way from undergraduate level for learning to graduate level for using in our research. Try F Sharp really lets us pull together some things that are really important to us, especially as people working with big data on the web. One, of course, is that because I can run it in my browser, I'm not looking at many different kinds of programming environments and having to teach many different things. I'm using it within a context that people are used to. Two, when I'm going for all these different kinds of data, I want to pull them together to something that's comfortable on my desktop, that talks to all my applications and all my desktop tools. And Try F Sharp gives me some of that ability. And finally, Try F Sharp makes me part of a community. I'm able to share libraries, I'm able to publish things that other people can use as my students build tools that make the semantic web accessible through, through the Tri-F Sharp system, other people will be able to use those without needing to know all the details of my research. So the community can really grow new and exciting things at the kind of speed we need to keep up with development on the World Wide Web. So what's the next frontier for Try F Sharp? Well, it's really to help bridge the gap between developers and data scientists in the information-rich spaces. So now that we've launched the Try F Sharp platform, it's open, it's cross-platform, goes across domains, we are really looking to the community to further extend it. So to summarize, we'd like developers and data scientists to use Try F Sharp to seamlessly discover 
access, analyze, and visualize big and broad data.